guys. So, last time we were in Galveston and now we're in Houston, but we've actually been in Houston for over a month. Over a month. <laughs> we've just been working and trying to finish up school, but we're gonna be doing some last minute sightseeing and going places and doing some fun stuff before we leave. So um, we're gonna bring you guys with us, obviously. Our first stop is this water wall. So welcome back to the vlog. We're super excited to be um, just exploring. After a month of literally just working and doing school, finishing up homeschool, it's been just pretty much normal everyday life things if you guys want to see more of that of what we do daily just maybe well homeschooling is over but just like a normal day in the life or something like that will you like this video or do like comment below so we know that you want to see it because sometimes i feel like it might bore you so let us know and let's go see this waterfall It's free, but it is Instagram picture yes. central out here. Definitely Instagram. Yes, it is everyone and their mama trying to get the picture for the gram. So, but it's super cool and it's free and it's just something that you can do. There's like a big field in front of it that so the kids are playing and it's definitely something cool to do if you just need to get out. Hey guys, so we are off to do another free thing in Houston. Since we're cutting our time here short, we wanted to do as much um, activity since we finally are done with school. So we have time to actually get out and explore. So today we are heading to Rockstar Park. It is a um, like a bike track and it has a trail and it's free. You just have to go and get these little like you fill out a paper and you get these little yellow cards that you keep with you and you just show your cards every time you go and it is free. And um, so we're gonna go do that today. We were supposed to go to the zoo, but... Like Texas, it was raining. So, um, but every first Tuesday of the month, they have free admission to the zoo. So. If you guys are ever in Houston on a Tuesday and it's the first Tuesday of the month, you can go to the zoo for free. We're gonna head to Rockstar Park and the kids are pumped.
it. Today is our very last day of Houston exploring and we've got a pretty exciting day planned. If you can't tell by my hat, NASA. if you couldn't tell from Sophia's squeals of excitement earlier, we're going to NASA and I can't be more excited. So I'm gonna warn you ahead of time and just apologize in advance for any squeals, any excitement, any screaming, any freaking out, um, because we are a little bit excited in here. We are gonna head to NASA Space Center. It's about an hour away, so let's get going. On Mars. <laughs> Weird. And then Neptune. 88, 90, stop moving, sir. 90, 90 pounds. 450 pounds. Do you see the guy spinning? Oh my gosh. Oh wow. Oh, 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 oh wow. <laughs> okay, so we have started exploring. We're now eating lunch. Sorry if the sound is weird. They made me take my tripod off the camera. So if the, if the vlog is weird, <laughs> like here at NASA, it's because I don't have the little stick part that attaches to my camera. But right now we are about to eat lunch. They have like a little food court area here because we are getting hangry. And then we're just going to try and make our way up to the outside part where they have the, um, like that airplane and the rocket ship. And, and yeah, it has just been so fun. Sophia and I are freaking out. We've just been freaking out this whole entire time. So if you know us, you know we love space and <laughs> so we are just in our happy place right now. We are waiting to get on the tram that takes you around this whole place. But we need masks. Everyone had a mask but daddy. We haven't really been wearing them inside, but I guess for the tram tour. We need a mask. 
Um, but the cool thing is they have an app and you can literally do everything from the app, like book your train, your tram tour tickets. You can do all kinds of stuff from there. walked in here and we both wanted to cry. <laughs> this is the Saturn V and yes. it's real, it's and not it's, a replica. It, it's not a replica, it is real. And they said it's ready to go, but they decommissioned the the project that it was for. Yeah. It's real and we are geeking out. <laughs> This one, but one of them. Okay. See, exploded. Oh, my goodness. Controlled explosion. Um, That's what a rocket booster is, but this thing weighs 70 tons, so it has to have a crazy thrust to get wow. off the ground just because of the weight. So, if you didn't know, Joseph used to be an <laughs> aircraft mechanic. And um, so he's just basically looking at all of these parts as a mechanical nightmare, is what you said? Because yeah. <laughs> if one part breaks, you have to build, like, fix it in sections because it's so it's huge. Massive, yeah. It's massive, but so cool. So cool. Oh my gosh. Oh. Oh my god. This is so cool. <laughs> Thank you. 
only two used rockets that have made it back. And this is one of them, the Falcon 9. Babe. Yes, ma'am. Zero to 10, what would you rate this place? 10, easy. <laughs> I'm an aviation guy, so what about I love me? it. Mom, can I do it? Um, yeah, he worked on military aircraft. Commercial, uh, military, private. So he's been schooling us the whole time. It's been so cool. So cool. So if you're looking for someone, someone, if you're looking for somewhere to go that's also educational and fun, definitely recommend. Side note, they have RV parking here if you're just coming through. You could do this in a day. You totally could do this in a day. Um, but you'd probably be tired by the time you get back on the road. But it's doable and there is RV parking. You could do this in a day. I know I said you could do this all in a day. <laughs> Um, but it just depends on your kids. So we have a three-year-old and he was he was done after about four, almost five hours. So it just depends on your family and your kids. But if you do stop here and you only have one day like us, it's so worth it. And um, you can pick and choose what you want to do, but it's so worth it.